Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to a mission to begin with because I did my intro but forgot to unmute me. So yeah, there was there was an intro but it just doesn't exist because well it does exist, it just has no audio to it. Uh, we're doing a battle against an extremely heavy lance. I don't like this map. It's an absolute ass. Can we drop over? We can. Ooh, we can drop right on the high ground here. Interesting. I'm thinking we might take that. Hell yeah. It's going to be getting very cramped up here. I will not lie. Uh, one more. Can we deploy one more here without... Um... Not there. That's going to be a dead spawn for sure. Fine, we're going to try there. Hopefully no dead spawns. So yes, forgot to, do, forgot to unmute my mic um, when we did the first intro. So we're going straight into the mission, into a three skull. That's a longbow. Jorgenmunder. Maybe. Ooh. Interesting. They're, pain, they're a pain in the ass. They're nasty. We're going to reserve this for the moment. At least till turn 18 to see what he does. And get rid of his spawn protection. And yes, extremely heavy mech, which obviously looks like Jürgen Munder. Right so he's move. going now. He has moved. I don't know if they know we're here. Uh, is anyone going to fire on us? Doesn't look like it. Well, let's take a few more turns. We've only got one lance to deal with so far. So, let's see. I'm also hoping I can get down from this point, because otherwise it's going to be an interesting fight. We're going to go now. I think it's time to go. And, yeah, we can get down. That's fine. We're going to sprint. There is the longbow. It is a. It is only a longbow. It's not got much armor. And I'm going to EMP the crap out of you. Because you don't have, as far as I'm aware, you don't have very good heat management. So that is going to screw you up. The blackjack is sprinting into the forest. It looks like we can only see the longbow so far. Interesting. Inferno mortars, Mark II overload because you've got missiles. Hell yes, that's needed. Yep, more heat problems for you. You might blow up at this rate, but we'll see. And I think I might actually keep you back this way. I don't want to lose you if I can help it. And let's just do that. Ready. Look grave. Can't sense lock turn one, although that would be amazing. And we can get six evasion. Confirm. Can we see anyone else? There was definitely other targets. We can get a line of sight. You know what? I'm going to see if I can... Okay, not with 5.1%. Fine. I wasn't going to see if the PPC hits, but nope. Not with that kind of hit chance. Duncan Fisher here. And... Heading that way. I don't want to do too much damage to him, so let's try and tag him and put some stability damage on Heading him. Heading them up. More stability damage, although he seems to be holding stability damage pretty well. And then the vulture can jump, I think. Spread us out a little bit. And more infernos. Turn those off. Manage our heat a little bit better. Turn that on. Um, and also enhanced imaging. Why not? Give us a little bit better hit chance. <laughs> more inferno. He's not over his heat, heat threshold just yet. But soon. Um, I'm going to... Turn that on. I get one extra evasion. That sucks. Kind of want more than five evasion before long. And we're just going to be done. Popo's who I'm looking for. Can you... Ah, uh, no. You can't get the flamers in range. Only the machine guns. Hmm. 
Now, I won't build up any recoil or anything. That's fine. I don't know if I do, but hey, I don't want to risk it. There's the reinforcements. They're probably over there. Yeah, there's a wraith. Fine, I can live with that. I await your command. Black to the jack. It can sprint out the trees. There we go. I'll race you. And yeah, let's turn those off. Just drop some more inferno mortars. Here it comes. <laughs> Structure exposed. No. Standing by. That's not good. Uh, we're gonna go in the back. Yeah, let's go in the back. That works, I think. Are we seeing anything else? No, nothing else over there yet. I mean, where's the other enemies? I swear there was other enemies, and I don't need to worry about sensor lock just yet, I don't think. And... yes, yeah, sprinting you. For evasion, and we're going to go after this guy. Try and get some stability damage on him. I'm not going to fire that, actually. Very little. Fine. I think we just go all in. If we blow him up, we blow him up. And still attacking the front, unfortunately. Probably should have sprinted to get to the side where he's not broken. No, it's fine. We'll do that. No! Oh, ammo explosion. Damn it! <laughs> ah, well, never mind. We, we tried. Uh, that was the entire lance. Holy cow. So, all we've got left is these guys, and that is a Hector as well. I don't know if that's any good. So, it tells me we're not going to be getting to, into punch range. Let's move. <laughs> oh, dear. Right. Nixie. Well, you have the advantage of... Ah, uh, gone past it. Fundermines. So, what hit chance do we have on Artemis? Pretty good. It's fine. We're going to drop some mines first off. And then we're going to look Duncan at Fisher here. dealing damage to them in a second. Because we are so far away with everyone. There's going to be a while before we can do any follow up damage, unfortunately. And Popo, <laughs> yeah, you're going to be, this is a very long distance battle. Yes, Commander. And so far they haven't fired on me either, so I don't think they have much extended range. Duncan Fisher here. Jesus, come on, let's um, pick up the pace. That way. And brace. In fact, I might even wait for them to move, see if they can come a little bit closer so we can hit them. I've got a PPC. That's about all the long range there is. Please tell me there's more than just two of them. Hey, 30 damage I saw pop up then. And you're going to take some more damage on the legs. Large laser. Fine. Oh, there's another one. Uh, Toro. Okay, so all fairly small mechs. So mines are going to be good for their legs. Yeah, we'll drop around this guy again. This is the last Thunder Mines. I think next turn we start doing some damage with Artemis and stuff like that. Oh, no. Keep sprinting for the moment. We'll actually get into range, but it's going to be such a long range shot. Are we even going to be able to hit very well? We might as well. Hey, you got his leg exposed, so that's a good thing. And then the vulture can jump. And. We'll see if Inferno is going to fire. No, they can't. 
We're going to go for this guy, see if we can wreck his leg. And we're going to go Warlord. We missed, but we did start a fire, so there is that. Which is not good for his heat management. Waiting for orders. Um, go, actually, let's sprint. Sprint, there we go. I doubt we're going to get the SRMs in range. Anytime soon, if I'm honest. A large throttle lasers, he's running, and a machine gun. Yeah, nothing scary at all. Laser AMS uh, holding. And oh, we have an Orion. Ooh. Another chance to get a heavy mech. Uh, that sounds good. Why? Okay. Let's go there. Roger. And let's see if we can hit anyone with a PPC. Ten, three, eight, three. No, we're just going to sensor lock. Do, 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 do. We're going to sensor lock the Wraith, I think. No, I don't think the Toro. Yeah. Large Toro laser. The only what thing that's reasonably good is this guy, AC-10, and it's a standard 1, um, 1K, sadly, so nothing spectacular on him, no good loot, but it is the mech that, would, that I'd be after. We have to try not to blow it up. That's going to be an interesting problem. Alright, so what have we got? Guided, airburst, standards... I'm thinking we save the Inferno. I'm thinking we go Guided. And none of those are in range. Fine, we're going to go Warlords. It's a 50-50 hit chance now. And Duncan to Fisher to here. First. He's still out. Oh no, he's out, not out of range. Awesome. We are clipping through our own fire starter. With a binary laser. Hmm. I think I'm going to go... Be done. Because I don't want to shoot my own guy in the back. Yep. Okay, let's turn that off. Got a fail chance. Let's not overdo it. And... Yeah, we'll see if we can hit the Hector. Not the best hit chances in the world, but so be it. We got him. That was um, that was unexpected. I didn't didn't think that we were going to get him, which is good. Who is next? Uh, the Wraith. Shredding on some more mines. Looks like he did 30 more damage to his legs. So, I mean, he's got 110 leg armor. So the Wraith must be. A good 50 or 60 ton mech. Yeah, I'm going to jump. It's fine. We're going to go Vigilance. And then we're going to try... To hit the Toro. We have the hit chance. we got the side torso. So he's open. Good to go. Firestarter, I don't think he's going to get into this fight again, but we'll try. But they're actually, they're not dead yet, and we can all be able to jump over that soon. So, yeah. Here comes the Orion. Missing the AC-10. Good, because that would have sucked. And no mines over that way. Yeah, we've got so much damage protection, which is amazing, and they're not really doing any significant damage to us. They're not hitting us with much. Okay, let's push inwards a little bit. So there's actually a road that we can follow. Let's follow the roads. It might be a yellow one, it might not be. And hit chance is garbage, but I'm going to fire on this guy. If we can hit that side torso. No, we don't. We could have got a boom. What can 
I do for you? Okay, we're gonna sprint. Again, partial line of sight. I don't think EMP is gonna help us. I think Artemis might be a good thing to start dealing to the Orion. Let's try. Good cluster into the side source, though. I don't actually want good clustering, though, sometimes. And... Yeah, I think that's going to be... Actually, we don't need to... Yeah, we're standing the flames. I don't care about that. Heat damage is not a problem. Hopefully... Yeah, we got the line of sight on this guy. I'm going to go guided on you, because I want stability damage on you. I'm going to try for the knockdown, I think. Standing by. And yep, yeah, just move. Got it. Most of our guys are not going to get over to the other sides. So there is that. Only the PPC in range. Fine, we'll fire. We missed. Of course we did. It was ten percent. This is all good. Right, and adrenaline. Go there with another jump. Yeah, we can go. Ah, we can't fire. You know what? No, we're going to go after the Toro then. We've Infernos, that's not a problem. We'll do some damage. And if nothing else, we cause him some problems with his heat. Do 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 do. Ah, sensors impaired, you get. It's fine. Is he moving though? Yes. Out of the mines. Good. Clever boy. One mine triggered that time. Duncan Fisher here. Um I can and yeah, no, I need to move first. Heading that way. Need to move and then only the binary laser there. I mean, that's a pretty good hit chance. It goes over the heads of my other guys. Let's hope we don't hit them. Lighting them up. We definitely didn't hit our own guys, and that was a good Go shot. Pow. I liked it. All right, not clearing just yet. We're going to go hide in the trees then. By the time you get over there, there might not be anything left to shoot. Waiting for orders. Uh, yeah, go move there. And more stability damage. Right to that. I don't know if we're going to get the knockdown on you. That was terrible. That was absolutely terrible. Yeah. But we're going to try. Um, yeah, we can see. So, three evasion. I'm not too worried about the Wraith. I am definitely worried about this guy. But that's a garbage hit chance. You know, what, I'll go here and hopefully we get some stray shots. No. We do a lo lot of stability damage with the AP Gauss and that. But not enough. Um, yeah, that's good enough. 50 and 40 percent. Nearly made him unsteady, but not quite. I think the way down is over there, but I don't think I need to go down. down. Kind of want to make this guy unsteady. Although we're about to blow up his side torsos. There we go. Lost and lost evasion. He's going to get to go in a second, so we're not going to get the knockdown on him. So I think you're just going to try and get this guy. We'll do some damage to him. So he's unsettled. Depend on what he will he will just move. Now he will sprint. Ooh. A connection. Yeah, we can't he's got no stability damage. That's not good. 
And Mr. Wraith is going first. Actually hitting the archer. Damn you. Impairing my senses. My Artemis is not going to work so well now. Ah, right. Flames. He, he's hiding. He's running away slowly. He's not doing much though, which is good. I'm receiving you. I'm actually going to stand and shoot, I would say. So, how do we increase this? So, into forest, target moved, max range. If I move forwards, we go into forests. It's still showing up as 50%. Fine. We're going to just stand and shoot on this guy. Locking target. Okay, tiny. Well, we did a bit of damage. That's all we can hope for. Commander. And then a jump. We can see what we can do, heat wise. If we can get him shut down, that'll definitely knock him over. He's unsettled as well. We might even get the punch Duncan out. Fisher here. We may well get the punch out. Let's see. Are you any binary laser? I need to get the MRMs in the fight, and they're not. That's a pretty good hit chance. We're going to go with that. Seventy-four percent. Lighting them up. We missed. Fine. Whip. And the Pegasi tank. Can go there. It's not the best hit chance in the world, but so be it. There's more stability damage, and that's what we need. What do you need? Okay, there might actually not quite. Well, we're gonna fire it and see what happens. Oh, come on, come on, come on! Ability damage was dealt. Standing by. Okay, we're gonna go there. I think we're gonna not fire those. We're gonna fire Inferno missiles because they deal the least damage. And he's overheated. We also got a head hit. Nice. And then striker, Position confirmed. hacker, duty person. Fine, we're gonna go warlord. Can we get him on cells? Oh, sorry. Um, no, we can't. What can I do for you? That sucks, but it's fine. Just gonna stand and shoot, I think. Yeah, let's um. Let's go for it. Uh, mostly went to the center torso. Damn it, now he gets to lose all of that stability damage again. But he misses his AC 10, which is fine. He is a little bit hot. We risk blowing up the ammo again. Yeah, the archer's taking a bit of a PPC battle, so we have to look at taking him out before long. And that's it, run into the flames, do it. Commander. Optio. I think I might go standard. Not because we get a better hit chance, but because we do less splashy damage. There is still some splashy damage. Fine. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. I think I wish I had multi targets. We're gonna try Yeah, we're gonna try and drop the Wraith now. Lighting them up. There goes the arm. There goes the PPC, which is amazing. Something just went boom! He's unsteady, which is good. And 
I can go, I can sprint there. Yeah, let's sprint there. We went over some mines, never minds. And... I mean, he is now an issue. He's panicked. So, let's see. The problem is I don't want to fire. No, we're going to fire on this guy. Might well be a kill. No, but we got him very unsteady. And we got the knockdown out of it. Good. So, adrenaline. Can you? You can make the jump. You can't hit his sides. So, I'm thinking I go there. And we go for this guy with... Uh, just dead fire. That's all we need to fire, I would say. Yeah. XL engine. Interesting. Just in case we don't get any other good options to take for loot. Heading out. Right, stability. Oh, okay. Yeah, that sucks. Uh, SRM4 destroyed. Panicked again. Good to go. Uh, we're just going to stand and shoot. Um, Artemis is going to kill it. EMP. Yeah, let's go with EMP. Less damage being dealt. We still, yeah, blew up the engine. And everything, basically. Fine. Mission successful. No. No big mech for us, I don't think. We might be able to take some big mech parts, but that's it. And we get some money. And the kills are a bit spread out today. So, yeah, one. So we got one longbow part, we got one Hector part, and one Orion part. Ah, that sucks. Let's see what loot there is. Ah, wow, it's. <laughs> We're definitely going with. I'm thinking the longbow parts. The Hector, what do you run? The second battle. Battle mech model introduced by the Free Worlds League. The Hexer entered service in 2471, only one year after the original Icarus. Built by Korean Enterprises on Stuart, it used a simple design suited for mass production and mass production, and quickly became the workhorse of the Free Worlds League. It has 20% cold shot bonus, plus four clustering. That's not too bad. The Orion, what's your quirks? Long range accuracy and plus two extreme range accuracy. Hmm, I think I might take the Hector because the cool shot bonus sounds pretty good. And then the longbow, it's missile boat, so plus six missile clustering, plus one missile evasion. So it's very much the same as the Archer. Difference is it only has options for missiles. So on that, it's not the greatest, but hey, let's see what else we get. Uh, we get most of the mech parts. We get the Tron laser, which is just garbage. Medium laser, medium pulse laser, machine gun, basic cockpit, small jump jets. I already have five, that's so fine. And mine clearance. I'll never use it. So yeah, let's sell it. So yeah, that was um, interesting. We didn't really get much. Well, no Big Mac, sadly. Well, we got some Big Mac parts. We got three. So that means that we only need to... If we destroyed a leg on another mech, on a, one of those mechs, we could then potentially claim it as our own. And... Yeah, let's do that. And skip forward, and let's go into another fight, I think. Um, one more day. Let's skip that. And let's check the barracks, because I want to see if anyone can get 
better skills than that. Um, what are you needing? Guts, maybe? You're piloting the Vulture, so... Piloting probably is handy to have around. Yeah, we're going to do that. Announcer in the Hellspawn. Probably wants... Piloting? I don't think it makes too much difference. We'll go tactics for the um, increased sensor role and initiative and stuff like that. Hacker. Um... Increased sensor roll, probably as well. McGraith. We'll give you some more piloting. Nixie. We can either go sensor lock, which would be, I think, pretty good, actually. Ah, uh, yeah, sensor lock is fine. We're going to go for extra guts. Cool, that is good. Optio. Doesn't really need anything. I haven't got anything. And aha. So where do we go with you? So plus one accuracy, plus ten clustering roll, plus ten percent cooled shots, or controlled bursts. Minus ten heat generated, minus one recoil. I think that yeah, controlled bursts will be pretty good there. That's cool. Minus ten heat generated is gonna be pretty handy as well. So we are ready. Do we... I think we go for another... Yeah, no point in going for that. I am thinking we need the third mech bay. So we need structural reinforcements, which is that one. 360,000. Purchase. Let's get that third mech bay up and running. And then... Come on, sensor. What do we go for? Three and a half skull battle? Probably not. I am thinking... We go against Clan Smoke Jaguar. We go for the assassination targets. Yeah, let's go for that. Maximum salvage. And let's deploy. Alrighty. So. Yeah. Oh, I like this map, actually. Um, do I like this map? Oh wow, we got reinforcements, supporting lance, and the leader. Uh, we can right. We can drop over here. We can drop over here. I'm thinking we drop on the roads. Yeah, just about here will be fine. So we might get some um, people fairly close. We might get a bit of a hot drop. Um, is that our target? That crap. So three full lances and the leader, probably with some escorts as well. So is it five, ten, fifteen, minimum sixteen? We're outnumbered, people. You didn't do anything. Interesting. We're gonna let these guys have a go. Get rid of their evasion. And I don't think we go mines straight away because we're going to need to push through here, I would say. So mines are not going to be all that helpful. That's coming from the flank. We have... Ah, we have... Oh, we have a gunship all the way in the flank. Interesting. So where is the leader? The leader is over that thing. That's the supporting lance. Reinforcements. And a support lance. Okay, we're still gonna reserve. Okay. Okay. Let's see what happens. I know you haven't gone yet. I thought you had. Interesting. It's fine. Regardless of whether you move or don't, we've still got spawn protection. He doesn't now. Damage is minor. Reserve. There's there's a lot of enemies here, so this is going to be a while. I think I push forward to take out the insurgent leader. Swarm. That sucks. Swarm missiles. And then we look at clearing out the rest. Um, can't keep going. Keep going. I think. 
we should look at going soon. Hacker. Let's sprint to you. Five evasion, looking good. Miss Lynx, Kit Fox. Nothing spectacular, but at the same time, they do a good chunk of damage. Well, they can do a good chunk of damage. And three evasion there looks pretty good. I'm walking here. Lasers have a very poor hit chance, so we're not going to fire those to save on heat. Let's go guided. Let's overload that. Okay, I think you have a Gauss rifle. Order. Popo. Sprint to you. You're not going to get into this fight just yet. But you're going to be handy for when we get to the insurgent leader because of heat. And Duncan Fisher cooking, here. Cooking him. Cooking him with fire. Uh, yeah, go there. Heading that way. So 37. 17, 33. Yeah, we're going to go for the mislinks. Better all round hit chance. Yep. And then Piranha. Cockpit hot seat on. And. Oh, yes. Yeah, six invasion because of the roads. <laughs> That's what I like. And. 22.30. Yeah, I'm going to go for this guy. He didn't move very far, apparently. Structure exposed on the side torso is fine. Ready for order. Adrenaline can. Yeah, let's jump this turn. We are only getting the lasers in. Front. Well, actually, no. Enhanced imaging on as well. On it. We hit him in the center torso. Fine. That just means that we're going to potentially get the crits on him in a second. Holy crap. Seven evasion? We can actually push it for eight evasion. Now, I want to hit the front because I want to hit the center torso. So, seven evasion will be enough. 33% uh, hit chance? Go for it. Ah, we don't get it. I was kind of hoping for the kill just then. I hear ya. So that's you didn't have to. Let's sprint you on. Oh, we can go there, get a clean line of sight on this guy. I mean, we got one guy down in a second. Artemis, Artemis, fire. No, we only got the arm. Damn. Okay. We have a Stormcrow, Bandits, and yeah, full lance down there. I go for the Pegasus. I am happy about that because that is a Nidhogg gunship. Okay. It's out of range for the moment, so we don't have to worry about it too much. But there is a lot of enemies going before we get to go. Oh, yeah, Gauss Rifle. 67 damage. Damn you. <laughs> and what else we got down here? We got a Phoenix Hawk something. And then another shot of Phoenix Hawk and a Demon. Interesting. And then we've got someone just come over the ridge line with lasers for days. We've still got two, three more people to go before we even get a go. And that is a ghost. Is that our insurgent leader? Doesn't look like it. Miss Lynx is running. Fine. Because he's running, it's going to be very hard to hit him now, sadly. Uh, what's our highest initiative? We, we've got lowered initiative because we 
now we got a straight shot there, plus two heat, that's not good. And uh, that's an obsidian skull. That's a freaking atlas. That is very hot atlas, but that is a clan freaking atlas. Uh, I want it. I want it right now. Um, I think we're going to have to deal with him. I think if we just overheat him, it's going to be fine. And standard, no inferno. Our primary target is taking yeah, only 80, but he's now pushed over his limit, so that's brilliant. Uh, yeah, everyone, everyone is pushing up here, taking out the obsidian skull. And if they can't hit him, they're going to hit something. Um, although, I could probably use you to chase down this guy. Let's just move, actually, for four evasion. But I'm also thinking sensor lock in the Atlas. And that'll get through your... I've got a sensor lock. Um... ECM, I think. Let's kill. Awesome. Hunted and killed. There is only one in that support lance. Good. So it's not a full massive lance that we're facing. Not there anyway. Uh, one invasion. Yeah, that'll do. And we're going EMP. 30%. I'm going to use my sensor lock on this guy, just in case we need to shoot him. I've got a sensor lock. But it means that we get through his um, shielding as well. Hopefully. There's a bit more heat. He's on really high initiative as well for some reason, which is insane. Go there. Can we? No, we can't get the flamers on target yet. Only okay, got a few hits. So it won't be until next turn that he has any issues now, unfortunately. But he's probably going to generate quite a bit of heat. Let's hope that it's enough to shut him down, maybe? Duncan Fisher here. And... We can actually shoot first. Yeah, we're going to shoot first. Lighting them up! That's a leg. Nearly gone. He's also tagged. And... Yeah, three evasion just there will be fine. If we'd had the other heavy MRM, that would have been brilliant. Okay. I don't think stability damage is key here. Okay, we're only getting... I think I need more than three evasion. Four evasion is probably needed. Let's go. Actually, we probably should shoot. Try and build up some stability damage on it. Yeah. Although that was nothing. Receiving you. Okay. The infernos are in range. Let's do it. Just garbage hit chance. We're going to go warlords. Confirmed. Come on. That's terrible. Yeah, we didn't do enough damage. Not enough heat damage, I don't think. What do you need? We can punch. We can probably charge, actually. Yeah. Do I charge? I'm going to go Berserker. And we are going... What the hell? No! Oh. Wait, huh? Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Buggy game. Um, yeah, let's try that again. No. Oh, what is wrong? Um, 
Can we not go for... We can't go for melee then, apparently. Hmm. Okay. One last try. Let's, um... If I do that, it might be because I triggered that and I still had this active. Is it going to let me attack? No. Fine. That's that's not working. What we're going to do then is turn at that off. We're going to go with 5 evasion right there. We're going to try and do some stability damage to him with everything else. We're in it. And we didn't do that much, apparently. He is in shift 22. Crap, that's bad. Um, all three of those guys in, guys in front of me go first. He might even punch my Shadowhawk. I just realised that's a stupid thing, isn't it? Yeah. Ghost is going. Should have saved my... Oh, crap. That's a lot of stability damage. That ain't good. Was that a pepper? No, it's mortars. Okay, the vulture's going to take an absolute beating now. The striker is taking a beating. I have to pull you back. We're panicked. Good. That's what I like. Yeah, it's because I jumped twice in a row. I mean, AMS is holding, and initiative 15, so we're not going to be waiting too long. We actually get to go first. Good. I am going to sprint and get all the flamers to bear. Come on, come on, come on. If he shuts down now, that'll be amazing. Yeah, he's got two large pulses. What are the two ballistic? I don't know. Are there two light tags? Only 12 feet. Really? I mean, there's EMP on him, so we can't even... Uh, yeah, we can't deal with pinpoint damage, and that leg is getting ripped to pieces. Ah, uh, this is bad. Is that all you're doing? Oh. DNI cockpit on, which means he gets pilot injuries when he's hot. Duncan Fisher here. Hmm. I am thinking we keep Heading going on him. That's a pretty good hit chance, but that risks so much straight fire. Please don't hit my own Lighting guy. Him up. We don't. Oh, that wasn't. Ah, oh, the heavy MRM wasn't even turned on. Damn it. You missed. Whew, thankfully. Um, there's still more of them going, and it's now me. Receiving. Hacker needs to... Oh, shoot in the back. I'm going to get three evasion and shoot in the back. Of this guy, the Kit Fox. Um, let's go, Warlord. Yeah, let's go, Warlord. Fire! He's unsettled. That's a start. Luckily, that was missiled, and we held two more to go. And then we are safe. Which is a Garat two? Which is those guys. Ooh, laser. I hit the side torso. Yeah, so our vulture is getting beat up, but it's going to survive, I would say. We can go. Six evasion just there. Let's do it. Six evasion just there. Let's put some more damage on this guy, see if we can get a pilot injury. Chainswords. I'm so glad that he didn't actually go for melee. No overheat injury. Okay. Yes, Commander. I'm 
Um, fine. We're gonna go with more infernos. He's still not shut down. Still not taking any. There we go. Overheated pilot injury. So, oh, come on, game. Be nice to me. Okay, we're not. We're just gonna move. That's fine. Two evasion. EMP. Yeah, let's go for the last EMP. Let's make sure he can't heat sink anything. And is that another overheat pilot injury? I don't know. Yeah. I don't want to punch him now. I don't want to punch him. I'm gonna go punch this guy. That's in the back. 60% punch. 77 kick. Now we're gonna punch. We are definitely going to punch. That's fine. Confirmed. It's a rear attack as well. So hopefully this does some damage. We missed. Of course. Negative. Overheat pilot injury. We're, he's unsteady. We've still got evasion. Good. So last thing to shoot at my vulture. Which isn't shooting at my vulture. Good. Firing mortars at Striker. Yeah, once we've got this Obsidian Skull down, we're going to be focusing on a lot of different things. And... We're going to... Go Vigilance. Then we're going to jump. I know we're jumping again, but that's... F fine. And... We're going to go there. We're going to go overheat. The last overheat. Hopefully this is enough. We got him. <laughs> we have a full obsidian skull. Now we just have to get out of here in one piece. Uh, that's going to be a challenge. Because there's a lot going on. Ow. Sensors impaired. Damn your PPC. I'm here. Uh, Vulture. If I go and move there, we're going to see if we can get rid of the ghost tandem. Is tandem worth it, or do we just go... I think we just go dead fire. Yeah, dead fire. We might even get the knockdown. We do get the knockdown. So, the ghost is going to be having a bad day. Uh, Stormcrow's getting hot. Blackjack is getting broken. But the Stormcrow's shutting down. Good. Uh, right, we don't need to worry about you. I'm thinking we go after the Kit Fox. And we'll take that in the flank. That's fine. I mean, it's not the flank that we should really be going for, but it's fine. I think we can manage it. We... 49 heat and an engine crit. Good. I mean, he's getting to go now, but that does mean that he's probably going to be getting a bit hot. Hopefully. Oh, he's going for a punch. Missing. Good. He's got no evasion because of that. He doesn't shoot. Good. Grada is missing. I mean, we're getting there. Duncan Fisher here. Um, okay, we're going to try and finish this guy off. Let's turn those back on. Now we're going to go for... Is he running? I don't know if he's running an XL engine. We're going for the side torso anyway. That's a pilot Lighting injury. Him up. Regardless. And we opened up the centre torso. Revenge is Duncan's. And three evasion. That's looking good. Heading that way. And 
da da Shadowhawk. Yes, I keep forgetting there's actually scary things over there. Blankjack, um, I'm under heavy fire. needs to, we need to get some more people over there to give more targets to them. That's, major armor loss. they seem to be fixated on that there? guy at the moment. We're going to bring the archer way. in closer, and I'm thinking it's time for mines. So that's going to really slow them down. Good. That's going to piss them off and slow them down. Oh, no! It's gone! And I think we may have lost Optio. Okay! That was some good clustering. Yeah, I hate your game. Okay, well, which we may be trading a blackjack for an obsidian skull and a pilot. Uh, let's not fire that for stray shot risks. Okay, that's a support lance down. <laughs> oh well, never mind. Uh, yeah, we have to evac. We have to go through all this regardless. So, fun times. Let's see if we can get rid of the last target here. And... No. Terrible hit chance. Terrible hitting. Terrible damage. Um... But I'm thinking, with the cockpit hot seat on. We're going to be able to punch that. We can. Cool. 91% chance of connecting. Let's show him what a punch is like and how it should be done. <laughs> or not. We're still going to follow up. Alright. He's gone. So we're now facing down here. And it's not looking good. Oh, Jesus, I don't like it. Damage minimal. There's also a demon, which hasn't really done much, but that's probably a good thing considering what it's running. We may lose more than the blackjack at this rate. Uh, there's a freaking summoner hiding in back here. <laughs> so we literally have two lances left on the board. Uh, problem is, they're both pretty, pretty scary. Uh, can I get... I'm going to get four evasion. Fine. I'm going to go... Actually, we can get flamers. He's still... Ah, oh, he's too far away for my flamers. Fine. We're going to go Vigilance. We're going to go Controlled Bursts. Generate a little bit less heat. And then we're going to try and cook the Shadowhawk. A little bit. Only four heat. Fine. We missed the chance to shoot him in the head, but never mind. Da, 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 da. Who is next? Announcer oh, is what's next. That? Has to move first before getting the line of sights. And I'm thinking. Uh, we go there. Heading that way. Let's go for the Stormcrow because he's still. Oh, no evasion, basically. We tagged him, we destroyed some bits. Revenge is Duncan! Initiative 21 is the other Phoenix Hawk. Yeah, we're starting to take a bit of a beating. And we've still got the Summoner and the VTOLs to deal with. Aye, aye. And... Sprint it. Seven evasion. Hell yeah. Let's go. Can I... Uh... 
That's five evasion. I don't want to take out this guy before he gets whacked again. So let's go for this guy. And fire! We don't get a good clustering. We're hitting the wrong arm, basically. We did take out a pulse laser. He's unsteady. I mean, these two are not going to be are not moving very far, which is good. We might trade more than just there one mech job. at this point. I'm not liking it. Because he seems to be running a streak missile launcher of some kind. Commander? I'm thinking I might start taking them out. And we're going to. Can't sensor lock anyone down there. We're going to sensor lock this Shadow Hawk then. I've got a sensor lock. Evasion unchanged. That's not good. And. What is our hit chance? Artemis? I think we go tandem. Because it's only 32. Yeah, I think we go tandem, see what we can do. Not quite, not enough. 13 damage, probably a Ruck 2. Minimal damage on that hit. And that's a Rifleman 2. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Rifleman 2C as well, of course. Um, can we. We can't sprint and get. Uh, we're going to go there then. They're not in range, fine. Streak LRM 15. Were we not shooting this guy a minute ago? Don't say we've got the wrong guy. No, oh, no. Yeah, he's still got a lot of armor on the front, but only six structures. So we only missed by a tiny bit. Okay. They're both running Streak 15s. That's why they're so good. Fine. I think we actually have the best hit chance here. So let's go for it. A little bit of damage. It'll build up in time. Okay, so this is going to take a little while to grind through all these guys. I think these guys are going to go down fairly quickly, I say, but I don't know. Let's. Seven evasion looks good. And sensor lock. Maybe not fire that. It's probably not going to have a very good hit chance. Sensor lock on. Doesn't really scare me, the Nidhogg. No, I'm going to sensor lock this Shadowhawk for whoever shoots at it. Invasion unchanged, that's not helpful. And that's the only guy we can't see, the Stormcrow. Are you kidding me? Uh, we're going to go for the Bandit. We actually have a very good hit chance all round. Good. Mortars are annoying. Aha, we get a line of sight to this dude. So we're going to see if we can knock him down. We probably won't. This is the last person for this turn. It's close. We've got a decent hit chance, but we get a knockdown. Good. Because we got the arm off. So the arm blew up, and that's caused the knockdown. He's injury resisted. Fine. Uh, 
Let's charge. I don't really want to charge. No. I think... We do need to jump, though. So we're further away from things. I'm going to go for the Stormcrow. See if we can... Get him. No, but he's not really going to have much uh, to do now huh? because of stability of because of heat. So let's go for the Shadowhawk. The LBX ten laser rifle is pretty nasty as well. Lighting them up. There goes part of his leg. Revenge is Duncan's. Heading that way. Uh, da -da -da -da. We did jam, unfortunately. Here comes the summoner. Missing! And 22 is one Phoenix Hawk. Through some mines. Really, really not liking my fire starter. We're going to lose an arm, unfortunately. Okay. Kind of hoping they run out of ammo. But I doubt they have. So we can jump. Yeah, we've got enough resolve to deal with that. To go vigilance. And I'm thinking before you go, we hit you with some dead fire. And we go Warlord to try and get the finish. Got an arm. Okay. It's better than nothing. I think he's now going, yeah. Where where are you going? You're hitting the striker, fine. Look a hard hit there. And This group over here is going to be nasty. I might not even have ammo to deal with all of them. That's the problem. I might run out of ammo before too long. And... I'm going to sprint. Actually, I can step on the mines without problem. So we're going to go there. And see if we can get something done on this guy. Let's go for Warlord. And... Now we actually opened up the other side door, so fine. I'm here. And... Maybe I stamp on, stamp on the tank. Yeah, if I stamp on the tank... I'm going to turn that off, actually. We're going to kick. We can punch him. Yeah, I think we punch him. That sounds good. We connected with four attacks. No, we don't kill. But he is getting... He's got, I mean, he's got a lot of armor. Yeah, we are exposing our back to everyone over there, unfortunately. Rifleman, what are you doing? You're only running rock tunes, you're nothing too scary. And then Nixie. Got it. Uh, da -da -da. We jammed twice, that sucks. Fine, we're gonna go against this guy. Hopefully, we get a good clustering. Do one down. <laughs> oh my god, this is insane. Um, we need to take something out. I think four evasion there and against the down crow might actually be good. 
We're not going to fire that. We're going to go for the side torso. There he goes. Good. No, it's not destroyed. Is he not running an XL engine of some kind? Oh, no, 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 don't. Yeah, we might lose a striker. We're probably going to lose a striker. Not yet, though. Not yet. You have still got some weapon systems. No, you might not have any weapon systems, actually. You don't. You don't have anything, so... Just some more mine damage. <laughs> I can think I can leave him for a little while. Oh, what's that? Uh, we're gonna go for this guy, and hopefully we hit that leg. We'll go control burst to try and not jam. Him up. There goes the arm. Sadly, I mean the LBX is gone. <laughs> Something just went boom. And I kind of wish I got the leg, but never mind. It is what it is. Now he gets to move. What has he got left? Enough to destroy my right arm. Fine, we lose some flame of hot shots. Ready for orders. And I can move, then shoot, can't I? So. Right, let's see if we can take out people that have still to fire. And I'm thinking we go for this guy. That's not enough to kill. We don't we don't have the alpha strike capability, that's the problem. I copy. Which kind of is bad. These guys are sticking far enough away that they're not posing too big a threat, but still a pain in the ass. And okay, what initiative are you? Twenty-two. Who is your twenty-two? No one else is here. Is twenty-two? Fine. We're not going to take down the demon in one go. Let's go after the Phoenix Hawk then. In the back with Berserker. Go there. Punch away. And we got. Oh, we did that engine. Ah, Royal double heat sink crits. Pilot incapacitated though. Not sure how. But we got him. <laughs> Here comes a stick. Summoner is going to be a pain in the ass to deal with because, again, we're running low on ammo. I don't like it. And we're still jammed. That's bad. Fine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hit this guy with some Artemis because I'm kind of hoping we hit the leg. Or we'll take him out completely. Uh, the LBX wasn't destroyed, it's crits. He's unsteady again. Fine. They're only trying to tag by the looks of things, those VTOLs, which is good. I think they're out of ammo. Which is amazing. Okay, what we need to do is jump again. To... Which is the arm that's missing? We need to go like that. Then we need to go Vigilance. Then apparently we're overheating because those blowing up cause damage, don't they? That'll do for now. Okay, let's see what we can get. 
we got a couple of crits. Nothing spectacular. That wasn't the greatest, but never mind. Standing by. And then the striker is going to go down. It's so going to go down. Let's see if we, at least we can take out the Stormcrow. Jesus, he's still holding in there. Just punch out, man. Punch out. He's now moving. No, the band is moving first. Getting the kill on the striker. Yeah. Fine. We're down two. Actually, hit 23 damage. That's not a rug two. I have no idea what that is. Okay, can we please get the kill on the Shadow Hawk? Please, please, please. Yes. So we're getting there. It's taken a long time to do it, but we're getting there. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to lose a heavy MRM at this rate. Not liking this. Holy crap, this assassination mission is becoming uh, what's that? expensive. We're going to go for the bandits. See if we can take that Lighting out. Them up. I think that's a bigger threat than the... We did get it. Pilot ejected. Good. And... Yeah, I'm going to go there and try and protect that arm a little bit. Didn't do it very well on the fire starter, but never mind. And okay, let's see if we can get this guy out. Almost. Oh, come on. Really? He's knocked down. He might be... He might punch, Hopefully he punches out. Um, we got the right leg destroyed, but he's still in the fight. That's a rear attack. Fine. It's clearing some mines. Not a problem. I might even just try and push for the evac now. Yeah, because we only have one and a half... Well... One and a half mechs up here. I'm thinking we go for the evac. Because I don't need to worry. I've got my loot. My loot is the... Um, lovely, lovely... Obsidian Skull. So, if we can get rid of these guys, then I'm thinking... It's all time to, ex to just ex extract. Yeah, I think we can do it. I think we can definitely do it. The rifleman's got... Oh, yeah, that hit the arm, which goes to the side torso, which we're about to lose. Fine, yeah, let's get the hell out of here. I'm here. Oh, wow, 30% hit and fail chance. Nearly. Um, you know what? No, we're going to... Sprint. For evasion, uh, we're still showing our back, but we're good on back armor, so that's not a problem. Let's go for the other leg, and might as well fire that, because I want to hit rid of him now. Alright, everyone out of here now. They're going to start pushing us again, I think. We might still be able to take a few of them out. As we go, because we've still got people like this that are running Artemis and Sensor Lot is not in range. Fine, let's sprint. Affirmative. Definitely want to get rid of you, because I don't like you. Nearly. Standing by. And oh, we're out of ammo. Interesting. Position confirmed. Well, if we can hit this, dudes, I think that'll be good. 
We're not going to get the hits. We can get the sensor lock. Minus one invasion. Awesome. 52% hit chance. No, didn't even come into. Yeah, we didn't. We missed by that much. We didn't even get on the screen. Uh huh. And I sprint it. Protect the arm a little bit. And there's only the binary laser in range, but that is enough to actually kill. Lighting them up. If we connected the front, which we don't. He is panicked. That's helpful. Minus two to shoot us. Okay, the summoner is becoming a bit of a problem because it's coming into range. And then the Nidhogg as well. They're also not liking the Hellspawn. Waiting for order. And yeah, you can't get into range, so we're just gonna jump and brace. There's only four of them. And the Garada is nearly gone. One more Artemis volley, and we should get him. Standing by. And let's go there. In fact, the Shadowhawk's looking pretty good. This is the pretty much the last. We can fire the AP Gauss Rifle, which is fine. Because it should be, if you have any luck, not enough to kill, but we connected at least. Right, we need to cool down, I would say. So go there. We're not going to fire any SRMs. We're going to go Warlord. We're also going to go Vigilance. And we're going to see if we can hit this guy. I copy. Uh, come on, come on. No. <laughs> that sucks. That's not good. The Hellspawn is not looking healthy anymore. Good to go. On my way. And... It's a little bit overkill. But let's do it. Overkill is underrated. Do boom and Yeah, I'm I'm happy he's gone. So who is last? I'm here. Um I don't I don't really want to get the PPC in range if I don't need to. I'm just going to brace you. Uh, just fighting out of here is becoming a problem, if I'm honest. We can shoot, then move. So let's do so. I'm going to hit what I can. And yeah, we're not. We're pretty hot, unfortunately. This might hurt in a second. Missing. Thankfully. I'm tempted to drop some incendiary down there. Uh, I'm thinking... Huh? I'm thinking you sprint and then move. And then shoot even. Sprint, then move. No. Sprint, then... Fire. Lighting them up. Uh, we missed. Wildly. Didn't even get on the screen again. And you're running away. Good, because you can't drop your bombs if you're further away. Because they're a close range thing. Yes, Commander. And again, we're just going to jump you over here. Brace you, because there's no reason to keep you. In this fight, I'm thinking I need to sprint you to get out of here quicker. Got it. And, and we can hit the summoner. I 
thing. Incendiary will be a good thing for him. Or a bad thing for him. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, you can get in. We're still going to need to move around the next few turns, but that's fine. And the rifleman is... Once we get the archer off the high ground, I think the rifleman won't actually... He's running Ultra 2s. That's who. He, that's what he's running. Full Ultra 2s. Okay. That's Nothing fine. horribly scary. And again, don't need you in the fight anymore. So, the only two threats are the Nidhogg and the Summoner, I would say. <laughs> and we're just surviving. The Hellspawn's not going to lose an arm if I can help it. Uh, huh? And yeah, just sprint it that way. Heading that way. So we got a few more turns because the archer still has to get off the high grounds, unfortunately. <laughs> and is about to lose a leg. If we lose a leg, that's going to suck. What have we got in the head? Show us. Sense Tracker, Artemis, okay, nothing. Ready for orders. Scary. Locking in coordinates. Rifleman, yeah. Going for his only target. So, so as I said, once we get you off the high grounds, it's gonna look pretty tasty. We'll go there. I know I'm moving out of the evac zone, but that's fine because Good to go. evasion is needed. Go right. there. I don't think I have any line of sight. No. Might as well sense along you. Are oh, you running ATMs? But they don't seem to be in range at the moment, which Ready is fine by me. And... You know what, we're going to just jump and then brace so we can cool down finally. Well, this has been a long mission, but I think it's worth it. Standing by. Uh, yeah, we've got at least one more turn for the archer, so we're going to get there. Again, these guys aren't much of a threat, I would say. As long as we can keep out of line of sight of them. Which we looks like we do. Oh, uh, what's that? So you're in. Heading that way. I don't know if the archer's gonna be able to get in this turn. Standing by. In fact, I'm going to reserve until he Reserving gets action. a go, which is next initiative. Initiative 20. And he's still getting shot at, sadly, but so be it. So can you uh, get in? No, we can't. Um, I'll go there for a line of sight. And drop some more incendiaries. That'll piss him off a little bit. All out of LRS, Commander. I'm here. So if we just go like so, if we get everyone in now, we just have to get to the archer's turn. Next turn, and we're good. We can get the hell out of here. It has been a costly mission, but it's a successful mission nonetheless. I'm just going to brace. Hopefully, they don't get line of sight. I'm here. And brace. The rifleman's definitely not, so he's out of this fight. Commander. Popo, just move up there. On my way. Oh, you moved out technically. Damn it! I didn't want that. <laughs> Gunship, are you getting line of sight? No, I think 
It's all good. So, reserve. We need turn 16. I should have vigilanced so I get higher initiative. Ah, oh, no! Some damage! But we absorb it. Uh, you need to get back in, so do so. And then that's the last enemy, I believe. So we can then brace. Holding and cooling. Come, where is he? Commander. Brace. Holding and cooling. Brace. Roger. We're getting there. Uh, huh? Brace. Waiting for order. And in we get. Not a perfect mission by any chance, but I will quite happily trade a blackjack for an obsidian skull. We get some pay, which is good. We're going to need it. Uh, well, yeah, we lost an arm. We've got a few crits on there as well. Uh, it's just the flame of hot shots that are a pain in the ass that we've lost. We didn't lose anything there. You, we lost the center torso. And the Radical Double Heatsink, probably. The Defensive Gyro Double Plus. AMS Mark II. You yeah, know, basically had an ammo explosion. And then the Striker. I don't think we lost it. We've got... You're uninjured. You're uninjured. So we haven't lost either of the pilots. We might have lost the Blackjack and the Striker, but we'll see. So what we're taking is a 100-ton monster. <laughs> and then we could take a Stormcrow parts, but I don't really want it, no. We got Clan Gauss rifles, laser rifle, light tags. There's my Clan Mortars, so I think we have lost that mech. The, the, the Blackjack. Fine, that should mean, I mean, there's Streak 15 clans. Active probe, case, don't care for any of that. DNI, ah, DNI cockpits. That's probably what we're going to take. There's a 400 rated engine, which we already have one. So you've already got an engine, good. Clan XL engine, we already have one. And the Dreadnought Gyro, that would be handy. The what I'm looking for is uh, Jump Booster Mark pa um, Pack 1, not that great. Clan double heatsink, no. Spiked leg, lower melee, mask. Retractable blades, these are all coming out of this. Uh, it might not be here. There's double superchargers, vibro claws, again, out of this guy. It's not there. The radical double heatsink, but I've got DNI cockpit, so I'm happy with that. I'm going to take that. We also get a bandit part, a ghost part, a phoenix sort. And the Swarm Crow parts. We get the Narc Launcher. Mm. We get a strand, <laughs> a strand, clique, an SRM6 streak thingy, armor, 215 engine, Clan XL. That can go. We get that, the IFF Jammer, which is good. Assault Jump Jets, interesting. Omni hand, single call in. Um, I didn't even realize it. There's a virtual reality pod which works with the DNI or enhanced in image to enhance them. So that is good. We get a perfect combo piece there straight away, and we got a mech to put it in. Okay, I think this is a long enough video as it is. So we're going to look at putting that together in the next few videos. And yeah, we're going to see whether we get the blackjack or not. But otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to hit that like button. And if you want to see more videos, remember to hit that subscribe button. But until next time, have fun and enjoy the rest of your day.